These are instructions for how to make a night flight called Bucket Microphone using Wildlife Acoustic Song Meter Mini. It's a design by myself, Dan Mennell, with Zach Gake and Natalie Sanchez. You'll need a two gallon bucket, a plastic comb, a piece of wood cut just so, a Wildlife Acoustic Song Meter Mini, a strong elastic, sound dampening foam, and some hardware. Start by measuring a hole in the bottom of the bucket. It needs to be big enough to fit the song meter through. Check that it fits. Secure the song meter to the wooden base with some L brackets. I'll use two screws to attach the bracket to the wooden base and then bolts to attach the song meter to the L bracket. Check that it fits. Now you gotta make sure that that microphone is in the exact middle of the circle of the bucket. Drill three holes through the base and then through the bucket. Send three bolts with washers out from inside the bucket and attach them there with lock nuts. Then you can attach the base onto the bucket using three wing nuts, making it easy to take them on and off. You might want to drill holes in the side of the bucket and attach two bolts. These could be used later to attach the bucket to a post or a pole. Now insert sound dampening foam inside the bucket. Add some more foam along the bottom, along the sides. Glue it into place. Next, install the cone. I don't know whether you would want to use glue or bolts like I did here. Now trim the excess cone. Use plastic wrap to cover over the top and hold that plastic wrap in place with the elastic. It's finicky work, but it keeps water out of the bucket. Now you're ready to record. If you want to change the batteries or the SD card on the unit, you just have to unscrew those wing nuts and you can pop out, have access to the batteries and SD card, put it back on, reattach the wing nuts.